Good day, and welcome to Hiroshima University's English Podcast. Hi, everyone. I'm Joe. And I'm Kay. 文化警察二十四時今月もようこそお越しくださいました。今日は皆さんのよく知っている国についてお話をしようと思います。私たちは日本に来ました。That's right. Today we're going to learn about a Japanese custom or a cultural trait. ううね。Sticking up like that. でバールがそれについて男性を呼び止めたところから始まります。男性は、僕は何で呼び止められたんですかと疑問に思っています。バールは、あなた、日本ではお箸をご飯に刺したままにするのは文化的に不適切なんですよ。知らないんですかというふうに聞いています。It's culturally inappropriate. で、文化的に不適切という意味です。That's right. It's not against the law. You know, it's not a law that you cannot stick your chopsticks in a bowl of rice and leave it there, but it's culturally inappropriate. To give another example, in Japan, it's culturally inappropriate to walk into a tatami room with your shoes、uh-huh. on. It's culturally inappropriate to walk into a tatami room with your shoes on. The man said, バールに対して理不尽だよというふうに言っています。Just absurd で理不尽、不条理、馬鹿げたという意味です。Right, it's just absurd. That means kind of crazy,、mm-hmm. like that. What he said was absurd. Or that movie was really absurd. It was kind of crazy,、mm-hmm. like that. バールはもうごめんなさい。私は法に従っているだけなのというふうに言っています。To enforce で法律に従うという意味です。Right, police Enforce the laws.、Mm-hmm. Police enforce the laws. もしこの違反切符が不服なら、どうぞ地方裁判所判事に相談してみたらというふうに聞いています。違反切符は英語で、A、ticket という意味です。That's right. So this ticket has two meanings. Everybody knows the train ticket, uh-huh, right? Uh-huh. And a second meaning, very important, is the piece of paper you get from the police. <laughs> It says you need to pay some money. I got a ticket. From the police means not good, right? <laughs> I got a ticket at the train station, that's good. I got a ticket at the train station, but I got a ticket from the police, that's bad. そして、to take something up with で、何々に申し立ててはいかがですかという意味です。Right, you can take up some problem that you have with the district judge, the police woman says here. でこの the district judge は、えー、地方裁判所判事という意味です。はい。district judges probably make a lot of money, uh-huh, right? Uh-huh. Yes, yes, yes. They're very smart people too. district judges。で男の人、たかがお箸をご飯に突き刺しただけで冗談でしょというふうに言っています。でもバールはいやそういう声はこの国ではとっても悪いことなんですよというふうに言っています。この国ではお箸をご飯に刺していいのはご物販を備えるときだけとされていますよと言っています。To offer で備えるという意味です。Right. In Japan, you're only supposed to stick your chopsticks in a bowl of rice when you are offering the rice to the spirit of a person who died. Very long sentence, right? <laughs> Let's listen to that again. In Japan, you're only supposed to stick your Chopsticks in a bowl of rice when you are offering the rice to the spirit of a person who died. To the spirit of a person who died. で亡くなった人の魂のためにという意味です。アメリカでは何を備えするんでしょうか What do you offer to the spirit of a person who passed away in America?、Uh, you don't do much as much in America. You do more in Japan,、uh-huh. but sometimes they go to the cemetery. Yes. Uh, bochi. That's right, they go to the cemetery and they put some flowers、uh-huh. there. Usually, that's the only thing people do to offer something to the spirit of a person who died. Right. 
で国際風紀法違反で申し訳ありませんが逮捕しますというふうにバールが言ってますね。International Moral Law で国際風紀法という意味です。Right, so it's not written down really law, <laughs> but it's kind of a being a good person.、Yes. International Moral Law. It's kind of a fun, beautiful little expression,、mm -hmm. but nobody will put you in jail for it, right? <laughs> 最後の面白い表現はちょっとしたジョークになっています。逮捕するという意味で、to arrest という言葉を最後に使っていますが、これに引っ掛けて、under a r i s e d というふうにバールが言っています。The police woman here says, you're under arrest. It sounds like very quickly under arrest. Under arrest. It's like that. <笑>それではゆっくりのスピードでシャドウイングをしてみましょう。Sir, my name is Officer Val. Do you know why I stopped you tonight? No. No, ma'am. I'm not sure. Sir, did you know that it's culturally inappropriate in Japan? To stick your chopsticks straight into a bowl of rice and leave them there. Now, that's just absurd. I'm sorry, I don't make the rules, sir. I just enforce them. If you have a problem, With the ticket you'll be receiving tonight, you are more than welcome to take it up with the district judge. A judge? Officer, you're kidding me. All I did was stick my chopsticks into a bowl of rice. Sir, you clearly don't know how rude that is in this country. According to tradition, you are only supposed to stick your chopsticks in a bowl of rice when you are offering the rice to the spirit of. A person who died. Unless you are doing that, I am afraid you've broken international moral law. I'm sorry, sir, but you're under arrest. I mean, arrest. Sir, my name is Officer Val. Do you know why I stopped you tonight? No. No, ma'am. I'm not sure. Sir, did you know that it is culturally inappropriate in Japan to stick your chopsticks straight into a bowl of rice and leave them there? Now that's just absurd. I'm sorry, I don't make the rules, sir. I just enforce them. If you have a problem with the ticket you'll be receiving tonight, you're more than welcome to take it out with a district judge. A judge? Officer, you're kidding me. All I did was stick my chopsticks into a bowl of rice. Sir, you clearly don't know how rude that is in this country. According to tradition, you are only supposed to stick your chopsticks in a bowl of rice when you are offering that rice to the spirit of a person who died. Unless you are doing that, I'm afraid you've broken international moral law. I'm sorry, sir, but you're under arrest. I mean, arrest. のダイアログでは、ご物販などにお箸を刺すことが日本の習慣だとされていますが、なんか地域とかによっては、ご物販にお箸を刺さないところもあるみたいなので、そこも気をつけてみてくださいね
We learned some important expressions today. Everyone, if you listen to the podcast again, we're sure your English will improve and you will really learn these words. では、また次回の文化警察24時にお越しください。Bye. Take care.